The fundamental number three in this video is streams. Basically, Aspen High Seas deals with two kinds of streams. Energy stream, represented by the red arrow, and also the material stream, represented by the blue arrow. The minimum information needed to solve an energy stream is just inform the value of the heat flow. If I click two times on this stream, you will see heat flow, a blue field. So the blue field means that the user can add a information to this field. And I have the black field that means it is a Aspen High Seas calculation. So if I add any value here, Click on enter. The green bar means that I have solved this energy stream. Most often, the values for the energy stream will come from other calculations. When we talk about material stream, we need, we need to add more information to Aspen High Seas in order that Aspen High Seas can solve the material stream. So when I click two times on that, the minimal information needed to solve the material stream will be the composition. And I have different options to set my composition basis. And the conditions of my stream. So to solve a material stream, I need to inform the flow. And the flow can be molar flow, mass flow, or standard idea liquid flow, and there are other kinds of flow on Aspen High Seas. So if I inform the molar flow, I need to inform at least two of them from phase fraction, temperature, pressure, enthalpy or entropy. And one of these two variables that we must inform must be temperature or pressure. So let's verify. If I define the temperature and I define the enthalpy, I define my flash calculations. If I define my pressure and define the enthalpy, I define my flash calculation. If I delete enthalpy and I define entropy, I define my flash calculations. And all of these will lead to the solve of the stream because besides the properties information, condition information, I have defined the flow. It can be, as I told you, the molar flow, can be the mass flow, or it can be, in this case here, as a standard, the standard ideal flow. And you see, at each time that I define a flow, the others two are converted based on the properties of the component. In summary, to fully specify your material stream, you must inform the composition of your fluid. It can be a user input or a result from a calculation in Aspen High Seas. You must inform the flow of your fluid. It can be molar flow, mass flow, or standard ideal flow. And you must inform also for the flash calculation two conditions of five. And it's mandatory to be one of them at least temperature or pressure. And the other three that you can define is entropy, enthalpy, and phase fraction. So with all of these defined, your stream is solved and you have the full specification of your material stream.